Ben and Jed, these parents say these school buses either don't show up in the morning at all or they drop off students at the wrong locations. And parents are worried something eventually will happen to their children. What? This is the worst area to drop before you're off. Off. I don't even come through here. West Main Street is where her niece was dropped off on the second day of school last week, which is at least a 30 minute walk back to her home on Waterville Street, where she was supposed to be dropped off. The mother, Elizabeth Kennedy, said if it was not for a kind stranger noticing her four year old daughter standing by herself in this high traffic area, the worst could have happened. And she just stayed right there. Someone's parent looked at her tag that was on her and they called me and told me that my daughter was dropped off there and the bus driver just left her there. Kennedy sharing this picture of her daughter wearing a lanyard with the big sign with her name and exact bus stop, something she says the bus driver failed to look at. She said she was scared. She said she didn't want to go back to school because she doesn't like being lost. Another parent we spoke to tells Fox 61 not only does her daughter's bus drop her off at the wrong location, but it has not showed up at all in the morning. She was late to school almost every day this week because her bus never came at all. William sharing the same worries others that one day her child could be abducted. My daughter, she's only she's like this big. She's like that big and she's so tiny. Like I said, anybody could just snatch her in a car and keep driving. Waterbury Public Schools issuing the statement saying, quote, Durham School Services did encounter a routing software issue last week, but the subject has been rectified. All bus routes are subject to change daily throughout the school year due to traffic, weather, driving conditions and new ridership. Now, I did also reach out to the corporate spokesperson of Durham Bus Services, who says they are updating all their routing information and sent an apology to all of those families. I also reached out to the local bus coordinator and have yet to hear back. I'm live in Waterbury, Carmen Chow, Fox 61 News.